Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the n integers. and also the string s yes. and then for each integer x among the n integers the program must replace the first x alphabet in the string yes with the next occurring alphabets in english so they've also given a note that the alphabets are in cyclic manner so if we have z means it should be a and we have small z means it should be small a so we have to accept the n integers also the string yes for each integer x among the n integers the program must replace the first x alphabets in the string yes with the next alphabets in english alphabet so the note is the alphabets are in cyclic manner now we'll take our first test case so here we have four integers so first we have two so we'll consider the first two and we'll iterate over them and get the next occurring words that is for a it is b and for b it is c so after that we have one so again we'll can't we'll change it to the next occurring word that is c then we have three so we must replace with the next occurring words so d d d then we have five so all the five must be replaced by the next occurring words so we have e e e e e f so this would be our output and then now we'll take our second test case so here we have three integers so first we'll consider the two because we have two then the next next occurring words would be a and for e it is f and we have one so again the first word will be replaced with the next occurring word that is b then we have three so the first three words will be replaced c f becomes g and b becomes c so this will be our output now let us implement our program first we'll get the integer n then we'll have a list then we'll get the string so after getting the string then we have
to iterate over it is for x in arr for index in range 0 comma ex so now the index of that particular character will be replaced with the next occurring character so if the s of index is equal to equal to z means it must be replaced to s of index equal to a l if if the s of index is equal to equal to small z means it must be replaced with small a so else the s of index is equal to o or d of s of index plus 1 that is if we have s of index to be d means then this o or d will convert it to the ascii value that is ascii value of d is 68 then we have plus 1 so it becomes 69 now again we have to convert this ascii value into character so which represents e so here we have character and finally we'll print the yes now we'll also use join here now let us execute our program with our first test case so here we have got the correct output that is the character are replaced so we'll execute our second test case here also we have got the correct output Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you.